Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bradicus with Bradicus, Bradicus Gaming, and today we have finally come to the point where we're going to be playing a different game. So we are going to be playing Crusader Kings 3. Now, I haven't spent a whole lot of time playing this game. I've been busy doing other things. So some of this is still a learning curve for me. I I have played the game though. I just haven't spent hours and hours and hours into it. So we are going to be starting in 867. This is the Wrath of the Northmen. This is the Viking invasions of England, so on and so forth. Um, and I am actually going to be playing as any ruler. All right. Uh, first things first, game rules. We are playing on Iron Man only. I only play on Iron Man. Uh, normal difficulty is the highest difficulty level. So we are going to be playing on that. We're going to be leaving everything else just default. So, and I don't run any mods, nothing like that. So we are going straight in and we are going to be playing Wales. So I come from Welsh her heritage. <coughs> My father, father's family uh, originates from Wales and Denmark. It's kind of where the everything happened uh, in my family. So um, this is uh, where I like to start. I like to start here. I um, played a lot of Wales in Crusader Kings 2. And we are going to do this here. So we are impatient, ambitious, and diligent. We're just going to take whatever it gives us. Uh, we can go ahead and just overwrite that. That's fine. It was one of my prior games. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do here is we're paused down here in the bottom. It's January 867. I'm not going to be hitting play <laughs> anytime soon. But the first thing we're going to do here is determine what we got going on. Okay, Galliant is fine. That's great. Uh, our focus, we're 21. We're going to go into stewardship. Okay, we're going to go up to 12 there. Take this as my focus. That will be great. I guess economics is super important in this game. Let's take a look at my son. Uh, yeah, he's kind of a piece of shit, it looks like, but that's okay. He's a diplomat with three diplomacy. Uh, we need to find him a wife, and it's start. It's time for us to start our eugenics program. So we are going to look for somebody beautiful first. Okay, let's see. Twenty six atheist Visigoth. That will be. Not good enough. Okay, let's look for genius. 20. Okay, this is a lot better. Okay, let's take that. We'll send that proposal, get him married. Uh, let's look at my other son here. We gotta start breeding all these kids. Um, this 28 year old genius will also be fine. Okay, let's look at him. Uh, we can look for um, giant. None. Okay. Um, comely, maybe. That'll be fine. Uh, let's look at who is next to her. Okay, let's arrange a marriage for her. Let's go ahead and clear that out. Let's look at uh, Giant again. Okay. Let's get some of this medium. Okay, that will be fine. Um, him. Let's look for, uh, so I think attractive. Oh, let's go for athletic now. Okay. Um, comely, beautiful. Was there a 
handsome. There we go. Pretty. That's what it is. Uh, this should be fine. Okay. I think that was him. Okay, and then him, we will go ahead and also arrange a marriage. Uh, we can take this other pretty girl. That'll be fine. She'll be a little older, but that's okay. Okay. We're going to go ahead and enact crown authority. I'm above my domain limit right now. We need to start a search for a physician. Uh, let's see. Manage domain. Let's see if we can get up to a six. Doesn't look like it. So five is about as high as I can get. Okay, uh, let's look at these folks here. Uh, Not bad, okay. I was gonna have him start on uh, development in my country, or my county. Um, I need him to start laying claims. Let's start with this one right here. Okay, let's have him start find secrets. And we will go to here first. Uh, we're gonna have him train commanders and then we're gonna have him work on internal diplomacy. <clears throat> okay, so five domains so what we're going to do here is we're going to grant this title to Let's see if i have anybody that's content i do not of course Oh, we'll deal with it for a few minutes. Okay, I'm probably the culture dude here. Okay, so we gotta choose a cultural fa fascination. I'm definitely the leader of the Welch culture. Um... think city planning should be fine let's also look oh he's an 18 okay that should be good Okay, yeah, we got to get some of this stuff off of here. We can't have be holding all this. So. He's ambitious. Possessed, brave. I don't really have a whole lot of options right now. I can't remember if we can invite people in. Uh, character finder, all, culture, let's see, you will not accept,
Uh, we need gender males. Come, we'll come, we'll come. Can't come, can't come. Okay. Okay. Let's see. We can grant him a title. Oh, we can't, can we? Okay. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and I'm going to have to risk some of this. Okay, we need this one out too. This we'll have to do. Okay. That has that all under control. Okay, we're gonna make him my guardian, or uh, not my guardian. I wanna make him a ward underneath me. Okay, we can put there. And we can just throw her with my bishop, that'll be fine. Okay. Okay, the first thing we need to do here is select him. Marshall education focus. Put him in stewardship. Okay. And then him. Diplomacy or... Stewardship would be fine. Okay, I need to watch when he take uh, gets a kid. She's a renowned physician. That would be fine. Let's give him intrigue. Okay, uh, things are settled in. That'll be fine, fine, court. Can't afford any of them right now. Debt right now we got to get out of debt and i'm going to declare war on this dude because i have a uh, a claim here for some of his land oh. who's in a faction i need to sway him get him away from doing that won't tolerate that for very long Okay, we are out of debt. We are going to declare war for my claims. We're going to just raise everything. And we're going at it. And we're going to be running at a slow speed right now because there's no reason to really move any faster at the beginning. You know, most of this is going to be expansion, small expansion, economics, stuff like that. Okay. 
Oops. Okay. We're just going to go over here, and we're going to land right there, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to break off and just station besiegers. And we're going to get and fight the rest of these guys. Okay, I don't think he's powerful enough to really do anything else. So we're just going to siege the rest of his land. I want him to keep finding secrets. And somebody's trying to murder me. So what we're going to do here is we're going to go to our council and disrupt schemes for right now. Okay, the sieges are just about done. We're going to go ahead and siege the other ground because we can capture people and um, send them out for um, ransom and stuff. So, okay. He's a little craven bastard, meaning he's a coward. So, I don't like craven. Okay, we're going to go ahead and let that marriage happen. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and enforce our demands. Uh, we gain the lordship of that county. We gain time fame, so on and so forth. So we can go ahead and enforce that. And then we can disband all of our armies. We need to grant this to somebody else. He is a piece of shit, unfortunately. Uh, patient, ambitious. Man, these ambitious bastards are a problem. Um, oh, here's a content guy. He will be just fine. Okay. All right, let's see. We can go ahead and ransom somebody. We'll, we'll do that right now. Okay, my daughter-in-law gave birth to two daughters. Okay. Twins. This is my heir. Okay. Um, Amentia and Kristen. Patricia. Okay. That'll be fine. Okay, we need to uh, let our gold kind of build up here. Uh, we're going to be getting another claim really quickly. We actually might have to wait a while for that. Let's go ahead and see our court. 
Who is this? Your prisoner and sister-in-law. Recruiter, gain a hook. Perfect. Okay, go ahead and start playing that again. Okay, we're going to see that done. And then we're going to keep going to war here. Eighteen, that is actually better than this. We'll get rid of him. Is there anybody with higher intrigue than him? There is. Let's go ahead and put her on there. Fuck that other guy. Uh, I need somebody with a higher stewardship skill. There we go. Okay, we are no longer in debt. We should be able to go ahead and declare war here. Somebody's trying to kill my son. Okay. Declare war. Let's raise our armies. Okay, one of the factions has disbanded. Nothing like some peasant rabble trying to raise up against their lord. Okay, that went ahead, and actually, we're going to siege it anyways. I want to see if I can capture anybody else. Forty-five gold? I can do that. Okay. We should have another prisoner, huh? Can't afford that gold yet. And I don't think he ever is ever going to. So let's go ahead and recruit. Recruit? Okay. Let's recruit him. No, impatience, fine. As you can see, I took the gold in the, the other one because I'm going to siege this place anyways. So. Okay, let's get that marriage going. I want these guys to be popping out babies for the next gen. Okay. Some force demands, disband the army. I'm above the domain limit again, that is understandable. Let's see, who do we have? Okay. 
Okay. I guess you'll have to do. We can always take this shit away from them later if we need to. <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and look at our situation. We need to start getting a claim here, and then we'll just go down the line and just take all these little counties here. So it looks like Northumbria is about to fall to Jorvik. <clears throat> so, which is normal. This is always what happens here. Mercia usually be able to, uh, is able to hold. So when the first version of the game, this up here, uh, you know, when Sweden was created, it was just super, super powerful. Uh, they've kind of, I think they've kind of pulled back on that a little bit. So it's not like huge detrimental, uh, uh, you know, Sweden's just out of control. So we're going to start looking at starting to build here. Uh, da -da -da -da, we will be building farms and fields first, I think. Let's take a look at this area. Let's take, um, I bet my control is really low. Oh, okay. We'll just have him keep on that then for right now. He should be good. Liberty faction again. Why does he not like me? Okay, we'll take that commander. I oh, can gain 50 gold there. We'll do that. Okay, cool. I ripped everybody off. Okay, we're at 169. We need to start building our economy up. I'm going to start with farms and fields. Mm -mm. Don't need that. Yeah, we'll take golden obligations. And then what we're going to do now is let's go ahead and go to find secrets again. Let's go over into um, France. And we we're going to try to start <coughs> bribing or uh, blackmailing people for gold. Okay. Hmm. I'll take the 300. 
<coughs> experience points for my lifestyle perk. The faster we can get through that, the better. I think we're probably still in a truce with him. And we're going to just let this development here just build and build and build for a while. I could go on a pilgrimage, but I don't see the necessity of doing that right now. <laughs> okay. We're just kind of trugging along here. I can declare war. Mercia. For what? Oh, he's got claims over there. Powerful is Mercia. Okay, we got a. Oh, he's actually really quite weak. Uh, we can go ahead and take this now. Okay. Move out. Diligence good. I think we're going to catch him before he moves. There we go. Definitely got advantage there. Wiped out his forces. Let's move in and let's take the city. Okay, here's a non-believer secret. So we need to make sure we pay attention to these. He probably doesn't have any gold, but, you know, using hooks against these guys and stuff is great. Yeah, he doesn't have any gold, but that's okay. So we got to pay attention when those secrets uncovered. So if we ever need to murder anybody and stuff like that, those guys can really help. While we wait, <clears throat> let's find characters. If any of these guys will come to my court. Nope. Okay, somebody was trying to kill me. Should be fine. Should be fine. Uh, let's do him, maternal. I'm gonna keep that all in the family right now. <laughs> We're still going to siege the city. Uh, let's see if we can get any gold out of him first. 50 gold, I will take that. Okay. 
currently not holding any prisoners. Dangerous faction. Okay. We've got some rabble rising up here. some off for another 30. Okay, let's enforce demands. Let's disband our armies. Above the domain limit again. Okay. Not a whole lot of people running around, but we can go ahead. Actually, let's grant this to Where is oh, he's going to inherit that? I guess this guy will just have to be okay. Okay. We keep trying to find secrets. Look at intrigue, hooks and secrets. Okay, those fields are almost built. Let's look at this one now. Okay. Hopefully this drops out pretty soon. I think we are ready to start building another fields and farms pretty quick here. Let's get that going right now. We might have to go into debt to get this next one.
Okay, we got a little hunchback in the family. Another one, huh? Okay, what's the secret? She doesn't have any gold, but that is okay. starting to build up slowly. So Mercia is, or uh, Northumbria is now demolished. Okay, we got a faction disbanded. Rally the troops. Uh, he raised up in my city there. So what we're going to do is, if I can remember how to do it, So at a rally point right there. We're going to raise all of our armies. Okay, we got a stewardship lifetime perk. We're going to go ahead and take that 10% increase. And let's go ahead and get to knocking this rabble out. This is going to get wiped out really quickly. I don't know where the hell he's going, but we're going to have to catch him. Um, no, we're not going to imprison him. We're going to leave him there. Let's get rid of him. Okay, we're gonna see that done. And then we'll be able to uh, go to war here shortly after we take care of this rebellion. Okay, we're going to enforce demands. We are going to negotiate his release and recruit him. Typically, these guys have really high uh, prowess. So, oh, you stupid. Can we execute him? 
Yeah. I don't want him running around with his stupidity here. So. Okay, let's disband all. Remove that rally point. Okay, let's go and let's make sure our control gets back under control here. Okay, we're in domestic mode right now. We're just going to speed it up just a little bit. Okay. We'll stop that. We'll abandon that scheme for right now. Should have blackmailed him actually first, <clears throat> but that's okay. Okay, my wife has pneumonia. I'll just let her do her thing. Okay, we can go ahead and declare war on him now. Let's raise all of our armies. And let's go in here and we will expand even further. Okay. Mm -hmm. I won't marry. I don't want to produce any more problems.
want her to keep that up. <clears throat> I want all that gold rolling in. Let's make sure we have our best commander in here. I'll go and command this. Vikings immediately off my shores. What's my stress level at? 40? Just is always better. Cynical is always a pain in the ass. If I end up having to play him, it's going to be a fucking nightmare. Force demands. So be it. Expand all. Oh, you know what I do need to marry? You know why? Okay, let's take that all off. I want somebody with really high stewardship. She'll be fine. And then manage domain. So yeah, there we go. Got me up to a seven. There we go. <clears throat> so now I can start holding more land. I don't need to start handing it out to all these guys. Keep my vassals under control. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and start fabricating the next claim. Look at her. Actually, let's pause for a second. Let's look at her intrigue. Okay. Let's see. Do that. <laughs> oh, that's fine. We'll reduce his taxes. Keep him from being pissed at me for a while. Okay, 149. Let's see. We got that built. Let's hit this one with trade port. Maybe we'll do a trade port in the capital first. 
Let's construct that. This county's control is up a little higher. <laughs> oh, cost too much. That. Forestry is 90. I think we'll go ahead and do that after our next war. Let's go ahead and blackmail him. And let's demand a payment. I'll take that 50. Um, we'll just take more gain. That's fine. Oh, my fame is long. Hmm. Well, we might have to wait a while. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and start laying claims elsewhere. So let's go ahead and fabricate a claim on Gwent too. We can probably start getting some men at arms going too. Ooh. Well, we'll just let them be cynical. Okay, uh, that's the end of the video. <clears throat> just a little bit of expansion, getting our economics in order. Um, once we have our base economics in order and we get the, these other two and get my uh, prestige back in order, what we'll do is we'll start striking Mercy and then we'll go down to Wessex um, and probably take out Jorvik. I don't know how big he is. Uh, yeah, he's pretty pretty tough. Um, actually, so is he. So we're going to have to build men at arms. We might go ahead and move in. How big is he? 3,000? Okay. What we might do is go through and start murdering these guys. 
get them low and then go and start taking parts of um, Ireland here. Um, maybe go down and take Cornwall. And then we'll uh, start working to Mercia if we can. He's pretty beefy at the moment. We can kill him out, though, and really knock down these troop counts. So I'm getting a little older, though, so I need to start planning for my son to take over. Uh, he's got a lunatic wife. We'll have to figure out what we're going to do there. Who's my next heir? It's a craven little shit. Actually, let's go ahead and educate child. And we're going to put him in a stewardship focus right now. Okay, guys. Well, that's just the start. Go ahead, like, subscribe, leave a comment below, and let me know what you think. Take it easy.